Yep, I don't expect much. Could have been better. That's actually better than I expected. I like it. Shows potential. Quirky, but good. That is way better than I expected. All right, let's see. Find out some stuff about cities of yesterday. Okay. Oh, the TES console, it, or Super TES is coming out soon. Okay. City adventure is terrible. Artificial intelligence, not important. Platform genre match, okay. Okay, new topic. Rhythm game. Okay, I got this. Alright. I think. Now we're gaining fans. We No! We're not moving. Don't do it. Rhythm game time. Okay. Rhythm. Nope. Rhythm. Um Rhythm RPG. And that's good for loss. Plus the game lane. And this is going to be everybody dance like a chicken. Everybody dance like chicken. It's a new game. Um, a rhythm RPG that I, I have, I've got nothing guys. Um, there's a chicken and he likes to dance in places and um you save the world from an evil corporation that wants to make him into a sandwich that's that's the game and you have to dance in order to fight people. Okay, this is horrible. This game's gonna be a massive flop. Oh my god. Rhythm RPG. Dance like a ch Everybody dance like a chicken. Okay. This... Oh my gosh. Do I have to see these reviews? Could have been better. Well, no doubt. What? Say what? You get nice experience. Beautiful. <laughs> Alright. Hey, you know, whatever. Can't count for good taste. All right. I'm down. It's fine to me what you guys are doing. Crazy bastards. Okay. All right, rhythm RPG bad. Graphics not important. Okay, well. It's good to know. All right, UFO game. God. This is taking forever to get through all of these topics. It's crazy sauce. Well, everybody dance like a chicken ain't doomed so bad. Okay, what's this proposition? Decrypt. Agents have recently... Yes! I'll take it. Research history. Okay, well then we're making a history game next. UFO. Okay, develop game. UFO. Action game. Um. Hmm. Okay. Well, we haven't made many games for the Vino Oasis, so we'll do one more. And this is going to be. Um. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, tentacles of doom. And exclamation marks get the point across that it's awesome. Okay, do it. My graphics are so dated. <laughs> we have no engine, but... Oh, well. People are apparently buying our dated games with, like, primitive, primitive graphics. No dialogues. Rowan, you quit scratching your head right this instant. You need to get... You get on board this here. Okay. Alright, it's not looking like it's gonna be so bad. World design sound. Boom, do it. UFO action game. Tentacles of Doom, everyone. Okay. Alright, and...
And now the play system is going to be coming soon. Yep, yep, yep. And now it's going to be a while before the play system, but that's okay. I'm down with that. Okay, release the tentacles of doom. Okay, level up. Across the board. Awesome. Experience level 5. Okay. Okay, special training. No! We're not moving. Because it's bad. Yeah, generate. Okay, well, let's see it. Tentacles of Doom! It's a great game! Yes! Action. Games work well in the Vino. Outstanding oh, achievement. The people go nuts for Tentacles of Doom. They love it. They really love it. Yeah! The smash success, Tentacles of Doom. Everyone. Wow. Creaming the competition. UFO action, great. Feels a little intelligence, very important. Platform genre match, great. Awesome. New topic. We're slowly getting down there. Oh, I never did make that history game. Develop new game. Topic. History. And it's going to be a history... Um, simulation on the Super TES, and it's going to be called His Door Ical Laughter. Historical Laughter. Without any exclamations. <laughs> Alright, Historical Laughter. I probably misspelled that, but I don't even care anymore. Tentacles of Doom! One of those rare games will set a new quality standard. Dang! Yeah! That's right. Um, Rebirth is working on a new game. Yeah, sure, I'll do an interview. Um, what decisions go into making a video game and how companies prioritize development? Can you tell us, well, you would usually receive more focus on engine or on story and quest? More on engine. Thank you for your time. All right. We discussed and asked how different development are prioritized. Rowan said engine is particular importance. Other industry professionals agree. Every development project has limited resources. Okay. Um, okay. And dialogues isn't important. Okay. Sequels. Finally. Building a great game is not only a recipe for success, it's essential to build hype. Beginning hype is mostly generated through random events. Okay. Yay! We have hype! The people love us. They really love us. Okay. Uh, world design. Get in the ring. Okay. I don't know if we're going to set any rec... Ooh, maybe we will. We didn't generate any bugs. Rowan's getting good at this. Tentacles of Doom made $3 million. New record in technology. All right, we're a beast. We're on fire. New topic: spy game. We're making we're making a spy game next. Three games. All right. We didn't make a lot of money with the TES. Okay, historical laughter. Ten. Ten. What? Must have more, please. Truly. Gr wow. The people love the historical laughter. Awesome. All right. New topic. Spy. We are number one selling game. We are a boss. Historical laughter on the Super TS is a winner. It's a lot of good surprises waiting for you in historical laughter. The progression of the story is just perfect. When you start things think things settle down, something surprising will happen. Simply one of the best games I've ever played. Oh my lord. We are a true boss. Wow, and I've never even created an engine. No, never. I'm happy by myself. I don't need anyone else. History sim, great combo. Engine, quite important. Platform genre match, great. Okay, research. Let's do it. Oh, did I, I just really research spy game. Develop new game. 
We're going to make a spy game. And it's going to be a spy action game. And... Okay. Looks like... Action does really well on the Vino Oasis. And this is going to be... Um... Spying on your mom. Okay. <laughs> no comment. <laughs> this one's... Watch, well, this one's gonna be the massive successful hit. People are gonna be like, oh, I have to play that. Dialogue's not important, obviously. Alright. Let's see if we're going to set any industry records here. And world design, not so important. Okay, do it. Let's see how this goes. Alright, I see all these bubbles coming up. That's very, very promising. Let's get these bugs ironed out, shall we? Alright, boom. Let's release Spying on Your Mom. New record in technology. Boom. Okay, release it. Game reviews. Boom! Is this going to be a success? Beautiful. It's not a 10. It's enjoyable, though. Good game. It's solid. It's just a solid game. Just a beautiful game. Everyone loved playing Spying on Your Mom. Okay. Alright. Look at my research points. Man. I'm just frantically pumping out games, though, right now. Okay. Spy action, great combo, world design, not important. All right. Let's research a new topic. Sci-fi, do it. Okay, we need to get a sci-fi game going here. All right. Making the monies. We're gaining the fans. Just boss. Okay, sci-fi researched. Okay, develop new game. Um, sci-fi RPG. Okay. Um, let's see, 17%. All right, let's do it. Sci-fi RPG on the Super TES, and this is going to be Earth Crash. Um, also known as Space Mama. Okay. Alright, uh, I'm making a reference to a sci-fi RPG. Earthbound, also known as Mother in Japan, but anyway. Okay, so Earth Crash Space Mama. And dialogues are very important. You know what? Everything's important. This game's important. This game is going to be a breakthrough success. Just you guys watch. Spy on Your Mom didn't do the best, but it didn't do bad. World design. Sound not important? Okay, fine. Okay. Earth crash. Space mama. The final frontier. Okay, let's iron out these bugs, Rowan. We might set a new design standard. Boom. Look at that. Look at that. That game is a boss. New record. New topic. New combo. Yes, please. No, we're not moving. I like it here. In my mom's basement. It's cozy. Okay, and I can't, can't do my game report. Okay, Earth Crash Space Mama. It is a 10! Epic! Everybody loves it! Can we get... No, we can't get a perfect score. Okay, that's fine. It's fine. Earth Crash Space Mama is still highly successful. And my research points are insanity. Okay, sci-fi RPG, great, world design, very important, platform, genre, match, good. Okay. And new topics. We're getting there. We're, we're getting through this music game. Okay. We got this. Alright. If you're not a fan of Rebirth, now then chances you will be after playing their latest hit, Earth Crash Space Mama. Wonderfully imaginative game world made Earth Crash Space Mama a joy to discover. You'll spend hours traveling through this world. To Rebirth, keep the hits coming, please. Oh my gosh, they love it. They really, really love it. 
Okay. New topic, music. Okay. Nope, not ready yet. Okay, we're developing a game. It's going to be a music game. And it's going to be a music strategy game. And we're going to develop it for... Um... Let's see, what? We don't even know what works well for strategy games. This has such low market share, I don't really want to do it. 16.7%. Okay, on the PC. And this is going to be a uh, musical wars. Okay, musical wars. Wow, we've never updated our graphics. We're we're super successful and we have like all right, fine. No story and quest. And we have, like, no up-to-date graphics. We're just, like, text-based. We're just... We're, we write beautiful stories, and the people love us. Okay. Alright. I don't think Musical Wars is gonna be a hit. That's okay. Earth Crash Space Mama was, so... Okay. I made three million off Earth Crash Space Mama. Okay, sound is... You know what? Sound is the only thing that matters in this game. Oh, a proposition for me. Managed to gain sabotage. Boom, do it. I'm a very evil person. I'm having my opponent sabotaged. But Earth or Musical Wars needs to Yeah, new topic, new combo. Musical Wars is not gonna be a very good game, I don't think. Okay. Well, let's get this over with, cause Oh man. Yeah, I don't expect much. Shows potential! That's not bad! Focus on sound. Served this game very well. Could have been better. Had its moments. That's not bad. It's really not. I was expecting far worse from Musical Wars. As long as I don't lose a ton of fans, I'm okay with this. Okay. Music strategy, terrible combinations, dialogue not important. Platforms match great. Okay. New topic. Ninja game. It's about time we make a ninja game. Um, they've been the victim of industrial sabotage. Ha ha ha. I wouldn't know anything about it. Alright, not yet. Okay. Got this. We got this game on the ropes now. Look at all these research points have just got banked. Okay, new topic. Ninjas. Develop game. It's gonna be a ninja game. And this is going to be a ninja action game. And what what does really well with action? Divino Oasis? Sure. Um uh, let's see. This shall be Water Melon Ninja. Yes, watermelon ninja. Okay. All right, and it's a game where you just chop up tons and tons of watermelons. It's the game everybody wants to play. All right. Okay. We're doing all right. Okay. Dialogues. Boom. We know dialogues are worthless in this game. I mean, it's all about a ninja who cuts up watermelons. Why would dialogues even, even matter? Graphics. Boom. Done. They're important. It's, this is all about seeing those, like, awesome, you know, scenes of watermelon carnage and hearing that sound as the sword cuts through them. That's what it's all about in Watermelon Ninja. I don't think we set any records. We certainly didn't. Okay. But I think it's going to be a solid game nonetheless. Watermelon Ninja, folks. Okay, let's see. The reviews are coming in. I like it, he says. That's Star Games. Action games work well on Vino Oasis, they say. Could have been better. Nice experience. It's not bad. It's not good, but it's not bad. We're down with this. Okay, we've been at this nine years. We got 15 million in the bank, so... Okay, the play system has been announced. Alright. Alright, we're not... Ninja action, great. Level design, quite important. Okay. Got a little bit... A little bit more money off of Watermelon Ninja, and we're gaining some fans. 
It's good, at least we're not losing them for a change. Okay. Alright. Successfully research virtual pet. Okay, time to make another pet pock game. Pet pock rebirth. Um let's see. Uh um, uh, Pet Pock Rebirth, um, Aqua Marine. All right, and Virtual Pet RPG for the game lane. Do it. All right. All right, and let's see if this one's our Smash Success Engine. Not important, it says. All right, I I want one of these pet pot games to be amazing, so that's the goal here. I brought it back. Dialogues are important. Everything's important for this game. This game's just gonna be amazing. It's gonna, and these numbers are not inspiring. Uh, sure. What are your expectations? Do you think game will be able to see? Be modest. Your time. Watermelon Ninja is now off the market. It's got a little bit of hype. Okay. Alright. World design and sound is not important. Okay. Alright. It's not actually turning out to be that bad. Let's get these bugs out of here. Alright, let's release it. Okay. It's not any milestone set, that's for sure. No, we don't want to move up to a new office. Not yet. Okay, Pet Pock Rebirth Aquamarine. Meh. Okay. Pet Pock games just never do well. Shows potential, has its moments. It's okay. Okay. Well, guys, that's all the time we have. I'm just going to get this game report finished here. We'll take a look at why Pet Pock Rebirth Aquamarine was such a terrible failure. Virtual pet RPG, good combination. Story quest, very important. It's a good combination, but it never seems to do well. So, I don't know. Anyway, guys, I'll see you next time. So long.